Chennai is one of the primary hubs for technical education in India, and today we take a look at the entrance exam that paves the way for students to get a seat at one of the most desired institutions headquartered in Chennai. Welcome to College Suggest, and in this video, let's get to know everything about SRM JEEE 2020. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications on your favorite college details, entrance exams, college comparisons, courses, careers, and so much more. Please be informed that all the data, eligibility, and exam patterns mentioned are directly sourced from the institution, and it may be subject to change in the following year. SRM JEEE is the entrance exam conducted by the SRM Institute of Science and Technology to admit students into the undergraduate engineering programs. SRM Institute of Science and Technology is a deemed university which was established in 1985. This institution is ranked at number 36 by the NIRF and has seven campuses across the country. The institution has set a record by placing over 7,400 students in the previous year across all of its campuses with amazing salary packages. The highest salary was 41.6 lakhs per annum from Microsoft. As a result of its excellence in academics and the diverse pool of students, SRM has emerged as one of the most sought-after private groups of engineering institutions across the country. SRM JEEE provides entrance to six of its institutions, which are SRM Institute of Science and Technology at Kartam Kolutur, Ramapuram and Vadapalani, SRM University at Delhi NCR, SRM University Sonipat and SRM University Amaravati. SRM offers engineering courses in 20 major disciplines with 40 specializations across various campuses. Please be aware that these programs are split among the six campuses and certain programs will be available only at a particular campus. Click on the link below to get the complete list of courses offered by SRM. Candidates should have attained the age of 16 on the 31st of July of the calendar year in which the 12th board examination is to be held. The maximum age limit to apply for the exam is 21. The aspiring candidates must have cleared the higher secondary exam with the 10 plus 2 pattern or must be appearing for the higher secondary examination in the current academic year. The candidate should have chosen physics and chemistry with mathematics or biology or biotechnology as the core subjects from the state board, CPSC, ICSE, matriculation or NIOS. Please be aware that candidates who have completed both 10th standard as well as 12th standard in NIOS are not considered for admission to any program of SRM. Candidates must have scored a minimum aggregate of 50% in Physics, Chemistry, Mathematics and Physics, Chemistry, Biology. While students applying for the Amaravati campus must have an aggregate score of 60% in their respective subjects. SRM offers direct admission to the first rank holders of all the central and state boards in India, top 10,000 rankers in IIT JEE, as well as top rankers in each district of Tamil Nadu and exemplary sportspersons at the national and international level. SRM JEEE is a computer-based test and conducted via the online mode only. A rough sheet will be provided at the examination centre and all rough work should be done on this sheet and no additional material will be given for rough work. SRM JEEE has a duration of 2 hours and 30 minutes and will consist of 125 questions in total. There will be 35 questions from physics, 35 questions from chemistry, 40 questions from maths or biology, 5 questions from English and 10 questions under aptitude. All questions are multiple choice questions and one mark will be awarded for every correct answer. Also notably, there are no negative marks for wrong answers. Candidates have to book test slots of their convenience based on the availability of slots in a particular center or on a particular date. Two sessions will be conducted in a day and students can choose their preferred session. The application process for the exam has already been started, so it's good to apply at the earliest. The last date for submitting the OMR application form is the 29th of February 2020. The last date for online application is the 30th of March 2020. The slot booking for the exam is expected to be in the first week of April 2020. The tentative schedule for the online entrance examination is the 12th of April to the 20th of April 2020. Results are expected to be published in the fourth week of April 2020. SRM Joint Counseling will take place in the first or second week of May 2020. On-campus enrollment will be scheduled in the third week of June 2020. The classes will commence from the fourth week of June 2020. The exams will be conducted in various cities across the country, as well as in five centres abroad. Students can choose two of their preferred centres while applying for the exam. However, a request for the change of a test city will not be entertained at a later stage. 
students can apply for the exam both online as well as offline. The link for online registration is given in the description box below. Students can fill up the online application and need to pay an application fee of Rs. 1,100. Offline applicants can pay the application fee and receive the OMR applications from the SRM Institute of Science and Technology, Kartan Kulatur, SRM University, Sonipat, and SRM University, Amaravati. The application forms can also be obtained from a list of post offices which is given in the description box. The offline applications can either be submitted in person or the candidate can post or courier it to the university address. All the necessary details will be available in the OMR kit. While filling in the application forms, be extra careful of filling in the right mobile number and email address, both mandatory as they will be used for all communication until the final enrollment is completed. Last year, 136,854 students wrote the SRM JEEE, out of which 11,245 students were selected for various courses. So, for every seat, almost 12 students compete, and the acceptance rate of the institution is 8.21%. SRM JEEE can be cracked easily with good knowledge of the basics. Though the exam is quite easy, it has a high competition rate because of the institution's excellent academics. Hence, students are advised to prepare with the dedication to getting a seat of their choice. It is always good to understand the concepts rather than memorizing them. So go through the complete syllabus of SRM JEEE and prepare without omitting any topics. Basic knowledge and an understanding of the particulars are enough to clear this exam. You must also concentrate more on topics which you feel are a bit tough and work at it constantly. With effective learning, proper revisions and regular mock-ups, you can easily get through SRM JEEE 2020. We've discussed everything about SRM JEEE 2020 and more information regarding the exam will be updated in the description box below. Aspiring students are requested to take constant effort to crack the exam and get their desired courses. What other competitive exam information would you like to see? Let us know in the comment section below. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and for more information, visit collegesuggest.com.